Hey guys, John from Lorenz. Uh, welcome to the beautiful Albert Falls Dam here in Kuzulu Natal. We're sitting just off the vet's house uh, down by the river. So I just wanted to talk to you guys today about the new HDS Pro. I've got the 16 inch on the bow of the boat and I've got a 10 inch here by the console. Uh, just to give you guys some information on what's new, uh, especially for the bass guys, is we have the 1200 megahertz side scan imaging now, um, which is what we call the 3-in-1 HD. Uh, it does not have fish reveal on, on side scan, it only has fish reveal on down scan, but we have the 1200 megahertz, so the side scan imaging is a lot clearer than what you're used to seeing on an LSS2. Um, I'll add some screenshots in here so you guys can ex see exactly what I'm talking about. Um, and then we have something called an S3100, which is a processing box for the guys that want side scan fish reveal. Now what side scan fish reveal is, is basically what Lorenz have done is they've gone and put two sonar elements on the side scan imaging that sit, shoots out at the same angle to overlay the, the fish onto the, down, or onto the side scan imaging. So it's a lot easier to find the fish on your side scan and then put a GPS position on them and then target those fish. Obviously the speed on the HDS Pro is a lot faster. We're still sitting with the dual dedicated chirp transducer supports, uh, channel 1 and channel 2. So for the guys that want to go offshore and want that 1 kilowatt transducer in the water with a, like a 265, that can also be done on an HDS Pro. So they've really gone and made sure that they take care of the offshore guys and the inland guys. Um, obviously on the Pro there's a lot more for the inland guys but we haven't gone away from the performance for the offshore guys. So for the guys that are fishing offshore, you're more than welcome to upgrade to the new HDS Pro. If you have the live, you'll clearly see the difference. Okay guys, so the only difference between an HDS Pro uh, visible features is the new little blue button in the right top hand corner to show you that it's a Pro and not a live. And then obviously the HDS that's written on the screen is in, in, in white and then the number is in blue to tell you that it's a, that it's a Pro. Uh, it's got the same interlinking capabilities as all the other HDSs so we can run uh, you know, the active target into an expansion port and then from the expansion port we can run it to all the units on the boat. It will talk across all the networks and uh, there's actually no issues. We can, uh, my, one of my favorite features is the ghost and uh, to control it from the unit I said to a, a friend of mine the other day is you know the nice thing for me is, is, is when we want to move from this spot to that spot I don't have to physically take control of the of the sticks of the boat or anything like that I put my cursor where I want to go I can sit and tie my bait and the, the motor will go to that spot and anchor when it gets there so I don't even have to worry about anchoring when I get there I can carry on on the boat and change baits and do all of that so that's a very very nice feature is to control that sneaker motor from your trawling motor be right behind the seat where you are you don't have to go anywhere um, and then that frees you up to then either eat some lunch or tie some new bait so guys yeah remember to like subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified every time we upload a new video cheers